All right, guys. I was listening to somebody who Benjamin was talking about the other day, uh, relating to a certain group that somebody that also brought up that they couldn't become MGTOW, and he was uh, talking about the fact that they could. It doesn't really matter what that grouping is. One of the things I do want to explain is people can become MGTOW even temporarily. Um, the reason I overlap stuff with the Philippines and things is simply because the whole point here is this personal development from my, my point of view. It's not that I'm anti-woman, anti-this or whatever. It's, fact, it's actually uh, personal development and awareness. So what you're doing is actually looking at things from a positive point of view, which is being aware of how the legal systems are, being aware that you don't need to get married and the marriage system doesn't even need to accommodate you these days because you're not religious. Unless you're religious, why would you get married? Um, in the West, at least. I mean, there is other reasons from the East, such as visas. Um, but the, the reality is you're looking at a environment where you should be allowed to decide for yourself what you want to do and maybe you take take bits from each thing um, the reason I bring this up is you may be mixed out now but then you suddenly meet somebody and decide to get married it doesn't mean that you can't um, take the best bits from mixed out um, up to a point and then suddenly think well I just want a traditional marriage or whatever or decide to run away with another man it doesn't really matter <laughs> the whole point is it's free of choice um, the reason I bring this up, there's a lot of people trying to focus that the only way is the way they're doing it. The reason they do that is because, A, it's the, it works for them and they're happy. Well, may be happy there. The other one is reinforcing it to themselves that it's happy and that's the way they should go. The other one being is they only want it that way and just like arguing with other people that they are the true, following the true path. The reality is, it's much broader than that. There is not enough defined rules to put somebody in little boxes like that. In the same way, if somebody um, has issues with women or stuff and are mixed out because of no choice of their own in, in the terms of they've never been with a woman, wouldn't know how to get with a woman, etc. It doesn't mean they can't change. It doesn't mean at all that... that they're not MGTOW. In fact, they could become MGTOW out of choice. But in the same way, they may have something that sort of kicks them up the backside and points them in the right direction. Because a lot of this stuff that goes wrong with people is around social aspects. And don't get me wrong, I'm not saying MGTOW is a problem with the social aspect. What I'm saying is some of these guys struggle to engage with women. I had a friend really struggled. Um, when we were younger I used to take them to nightclubs. I'd start chatting to some women, get them involved, then I'd disappear to the toilet somewhere for 10 minutes. I'd come back and they're gone. And it's like, what do, oh, well, she had a big nose, she had this. It was like, there's always an excuse. But reality is, he didn't look into himself and say, look, half the problem is confidence. The other half is the standards like, um, what do you call it there? Uh, he's, he's, he's looked for number of tens when he, he'd be lucky for a five. Not because of any fault of his own, it's just simply it's more to do with where he was. Because for a start, he's not um, from Britain originally, so it puts him at a disadvantage sometimes. Um, but at the same time, he's, he's now happily married. And he's in a very good relationship. The woman he's with um, is a very good, strong woman. And, I, and I'm not saying what he calls his wife, but um, they're in a very good relationship. Now, could he have been mixed out? Um, very easily. The only problem he had was he had a lot of stuff that would put people off even talking to him for a long time. He would turn up at your house and you say don't and stuff because he was bored and things. There was a lot of antisocial stuff that he did without really understanding what he was doing was annoying and wrong. Um, so the, the point being is, someday that has changed. He is married. He has met somebody that, that will slap him around and say stop being there or whatever. And she will put him in the right direction. 
but she's a pretty strong woman anyway. But the, the point being is people do change. And that's one of the things I will say. People say, oh, you're not this or whatever. You can be what you like. That's the whole point of choice. You may not follow the rules to the T. You will always get somebody to go, you're wrong on this and wrong on that. Because they have a, a different path. It doesn't mean they're, they're on a different path, though, in the sense of they're not trying to follow the same rules. It just means that they're following it in a different way. Thanks for watching.